And we're back with the K1 World Grand Prix 2016 Japan K1 Featherweight World Championship Tournament at the Yoyogi Yo National Gymnasium. In the second gymnasium, we've got 4,800 screaming fans ready for this next bout here to kick off. Some semi-final action in the tournament. In the red corner, Kaito Ozawa taking on, in the blue, Elias Mamudi. I'm Brian. And I'm Phil, and let's see what pops off in the ring tonight. That's right, go. man. Hopefully, Elias Mahmoudi's corner gave him yeah. the spa treatment backstage oh, man. His in order to refresh. Man. He ran a marathon. Yeah. Um, Kaito Ozawa, though, having the quick KO, so very yeah. different paths to this match here from yeah. these guys. Ooh! Man, his reach, man. He's just letting it go from the outset again, man. Yeah. But you know what? Why not, man? Why not? Exactly. It could, could, in the long term, really be a genius tactic from him. Well, and Ozawa um, getting pushed back, forced um, to get a little wild and throw yeah. some big shots there, and that's what Mamudi wants. You want to open up, make mistakes, make wins, man. I mean, that's it. You know, you, if you're finding someone's mistake, let the guard down, you know, get a little bit, you know, feel themselves, and that's when you, that's when you get, that's when you get that opportunity to get, land a big, a big shot. You're right. Well, you can see the distance here too. Uh, Mahmoudi has established mm -hmm. a long distance for this fight. Kaito's now got to work his way in there, mm -hmm. uh, which is going to be real tough. And Mahmoudi, you know, just 18 years old, so he is going to recover fast. Oh yeah, and he's looking really fresh right now. Looking great. Ooh, and that big mm. left kick. Ooh, well, Kaito, he's in danger zone. Cut. Yeah, Kaito just so fast, able to cut that distance. Ooh, but Ooh, getting but, caught there with a few shots. Moody, man, he's all right. Let's do it. He's happy, man. Some great back and forth there. Yeah. The fans love that. Ah. Just a little bit of a snag there mm -hmm. on one of the knees, and that is not allowed under the K1 rule set. So now Moody going to get a warning here. Yeah, when he, th things are getting hot, man, it happens. You know, it's, you, yep. can't, you can't really... Uh, Unless your training is, unless you know, you're, you know, I don't even know, like using, you know, every inch of your, your, your brain, mm -hmm. <laughs> you, yeah. do, you lose sight of the rules sometimes. That's right. If you train to grab the head and throw the knee, it's very hard not to do. Yeah. Ooh, great front kick yeah. there. Kaito getting pushed back. Um, Kaito having some good moments earlier in the round, but mm -hmm. overall it's, it's very difficult for him to get in here because mm -hmm. Mahmoudi's unleashing. Big left kicks, big yeah, front kicks. He got him. Kicks. Got him in the uh, the kintama, the golden, golden ball, golden balls. That's why we'll see. Uh, Mamudi going to take a little time here to recover. Um, about one minute left in the round. And, yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Yep. yeah. It's about as flush as it could be. Yeah. At 18, you want to watch out for that. <laughs> yeah. I think. I, yeah. Any age above 70, you probably want to watch out yeah, for that one. Yeah, yeah. Even at 40, man. <laughs> it's all good. Sometimes, sometimes I forget mm. they're there. But 18, man. It's about 90% of your life. Wow, and another one downstairs. Um, I, I, it's you know, not intentional, but um, definitely going to hurt Mahmoudi's rhythm a little bit. Mm -hmm. yeah, they're going to replay. He just go through Ooh. another replay here. Yeah, he's like, oh man. And see, when you get hit there, yeah. for uh, the ladies, uh, when, you, when you get hit there, man, the, the pain builds up. It's not an immediate pain. Mm. It's, um, yeah, it's, uh, it's, 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 it's not nice. And yeah. it lasts. It's horrible. It's horrible. And, um, you know, I, I, to Kaito's credit, I've fought some fairly tall, tall guys. It's before. tough, yeah. And it's kind of a, a no man's land where you're, you No, know, normally it would be a mid kick. Mm hmm. Um, you know, you're kind of trying to attack, and uh, it just, yeah, your foot winds up there. Yeah. Not, not intentionally at all. At 18, man, that's probably the most important part of your body. <laughs> He's thinking about, okay, when <laughs> can I use these tonight? Yeah, two, two hard direct blows. Unfortunately, you know, this, this happens. Um, you yeah, know, it's surprising yeah. sometimes you don't see it more. Yeah. Um, but and it hurts, man. Everybody's thinking he's trying to catch his breath. No, man. It. Yeah. I, you know, you've been hit there. I've been hit mm. there. It's. It sucks. Yeah. Well, and really, <laughs> it sucks you, so you sometimes bad. you get hit there, and it still hurts a little bit. You just want to get back to the flow of the yeah. match. You, yeah. you don't want to cool down a little. Yeah. Um, 
but he's just trying to because it's a nauseating feel. It's yes. A, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. It feels like you're cramped. <laughs> um, you're cramped up. Yeah. Hey, the inside. Maybe that's uh, women experience once a month. I don't know. Oosh. Yeah, Moody just gonna have to kind of power through the rest of this round um, to get that rhythm back. But doing a good job with that front kick. You know, the only problem this Mamoudi really has in his matches is when things get close, sometimes the guard is just not as tight as it could be. Yeah. And he's vulnerable to these hooking shots. Mm -hmm. um, if you can just pull that guard in just a little bit tighter, his knees are such a great yeah. attack. Yeah. yeah. He's kind of out of it. He has to get back into it mentally. I think he's kind of slipped out of... Uh... Yeah, well, if you've never been um, in the ring, too, like for people that haven't, there is just, there is a rhythm, there's a flow, there's a zone to all of this that you feel. And when that gets broken, mm -hmm. you gotta find that again. You gotta find right? it again, yeah. It's only the first round, too. Mm, Kaito with, uh, doing exactly what he needs to do, getting out of the way of the strike, and then coming in with four of his own. Mm -hmm. Nice combination there from Kaito. Yeah. Mamuri just needs to survive this round. Um, maybe Ooh. hit the corner to ice. Yeah, what do you the do? Jewels, man. Ooh. Because all you want to do is just take off that cup and just, just look at him and say, it's, they were, it's okay, my friends. You know, but uh, you can't. Nope, there is nothing you can do. Just a hard place to be. The wind blown out of the sails. Let's see what Mamuri's corner, what sort of advice they give him here. Kaito, at the, there at the end, was sort of the key to what he can do. Mm -hmm. is get in and out, yeah. make him miss, and then be on him mm -hmm. um, and, with punches and kicks. What happens, yeah, because Kaito definitely was at the end of that round. He, you can see his confidence. He was yeah. like, okay, come on, throw, throw something because I'm gonna counter. Red, ah, getting caught with a back fist. Mahmoudi, too, expending a lot of energy in this lead round, in this first round mm -hmm. here. We'll see if it was like the previous match where he kind of falls off in the second and third because it's just so hard to maintain that pace. Kaito, um, also being fresh from the from his second yeah. quarterfinal match. Yeah. Might have a lot of stamina here mm -hmm. that he can expend. And yeah. He might be able to up his own pressure. Yeah, I think um, Kaito has a good chance. Ah, I snagged the kick. kick. Ref says it's okay. Ooh. Yeah, good combos, shots. man. Yeah, man, I think. Yeah, I think Modi has excellent output, right? Mm. But I think he's always at 100%. I, I and I think that kind of poops him out a little bit. He, yeah. He doesn't really have like a 75% yeah. like kind yeah. of coasting with it. He's just all out all the time. And I think that might be working against him um, if he doesn't get that KO soon. You know what I mean? Well, and if, if Kaito um, can start to time him a little bit better and make some of those big shots miss, because they're so heavy, they're also really committed. And mm -hmm. that means that Mamuri gets stuck on his front foot, mm -hmm. um, which Kaito, Kaito can take advantage of. Yeah. Um, you know, Mamuri definitely, I th you're absolutely right. Like, if he could just vary the pace a little bit, mm -hmm. the rhythm, um, you know, expose himself a little bit less, he's got great power. Yeah. And he's got great timing. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Those Excellent kicks. kicks. Are awesome. Yeah. So it's going to be all, you know, contingent on Ozawa's ability here to. Uh, get out of the way yeah. and come in with some counter work because we know him, what Mahmoudi's bringing. Yeah. He's bringing 100% on each yeah. strike. Each strike, which is great, but you get tired. Yes. Yep, just changing that rhythm and it throws your opponent off too. Mm -hmm. Here's a soft jab. Here's a fast exactly. jab. Here's yeah. a hard jab. Yeah, exactly. You know, all the great, um, great boxers, kickboxers tend to have, you know, these rhythmic changes that they make. Yeah, we have a minute left here in the in the, the second round. Um, yeah, kind of, kind of not taking advantage of this moment here, Ramu. Mahmoudi's being a little bit quiet. Yeah, you know, I I, I think it, what it might be too is Kato Kato doesn't want to uh, hit another, get another low blow. I think because um, mm. that 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 thing that plays a factor. As you know, unless you're a complete sociopath, you don't you don't want to <laughs> you know you don't want to do that again. I think that's that might be something that. Ooh, nice. Got him. Oh, great shot. Hurt him in the body. You can see the delayed reaction and the look on Mamudu's face. The poker face. Kaito, wow. 
free. Well, he did take care of, or did take advantage of the lull there. Yeah. Uh, the lull in the pace, and that's what he needed to do with a big spinning kick. Yeah. Now maybe it, maybe he has to him downstairs was maybe a low blow. Yeah. We didn't see that. I, I don't know. know. Um, but Kaito doing exactly what he needs to do. Kaito looking for blood. They're gonna call it down. He doesn't move out the way. Ooh, good. I don't know if he planned to do that, but that was an excellent uh, front kick. Yeah. Kicks wow, his back leg out from the Drama there. Lots of drama in this fight. Wow. Now that wasn't that wasn't a low blow, man. At least at least not from what I saw, man. He does this perfect spinning uh, back kick. Almost looked like it was up on the chest. Yeah, yeah. Heart attack. Strike to the lungs, man. Yeah, that was beautiful. Hopefully we'll get to see a replay of that. Um, but you're right, Mahmoudi had a nice fancy little front kick there, mm -hmm. just kicking out the leg. Right here. Wow, oh, caught him right in this. Oh, yeah, he... <laughs> he, he, um, he hooked it yeah. behind the elbow there. Yeah. That was a great shot. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, Ooh, that's right a on the kick. liver too, yeah. man. So Mahmoudi getting hit low to the groin and then also getting hit to the internal oh, man, groin, yeah. which is the liver. <laughs> oh, that's what's your name? Uh, famous Japanese uh, model. Lola? Lola, yeah. Lola. Lola. Let's see. That's That's right, round three. Lots of drama so far here in this matchup. Um, Mahmoudi just having a brutal fight his first go, and then, you know, having to deal with the low blows, the body shot there. He's as tough as nails, man. Yeah. He's got his guard up right now. Yeah, man, this, yeah, he's great he's fighter. In the trenches. Yeah, man. First round, very tough first round. Um, and a very, very tough second round. Um, For 18 years old, there's just so much game in this kid. Oh, yeah, he's gonna learn a lot. Mm. Oh, going up with the knee. Yeah, for young fighters out there, compete, compete. You know, mm. um, this is where this is this is whoa, this is where you learn. Cause after that, you know, after this tournament, Modi's gonna you know go back to train, mm. and he's gonna have so much more knowledge, man. This is it's like a it's like a college semester or or a course, you know. Yeah, exactly. Oh, exactly. You know, he could have. He could have, you know, he's getting such valuable information from this experience here. He could go have 10 wins against lackluster opponents, mm -hmm. but one tough round here in this K1 tournament is worth all of those yeah. 10 victories. Oh yeah, definitely. Um, well, yeah, because you're only as you're only you're only as good as as as, as the people that you fight. You know, if, if you fight, you know, people who are not as skilled as you, then you're not going to skill up. So you have, you know, that's what losing is all about, right? Is being outskilled, out outmatched. And that's and that's where you learn. Yeah, well, and the and the what I love about Japan is um, the way that the Japanese gyms will just not shy away from tough competition. Mm -hmm. They'll put their fighters up against the best guys. Um, and sometimes even a little early, I feel like. Um, but they they compete hard, man. Yeah. And the it's not so important to have an unblemished record. Mm -hmm. um, just yeah, yeah. in Asia in general, mm -hmm. Muay Thai or kickboxing, and yeah, you you have to go through these tough experiences, these tough losses. Um, to improve. Yeah. Ooh. Kind of a lull here. Kaito knowing, you know, he's got that down yeah. in the bank. Um, so not having to get too wild. Yeah. Smart. Uh, Mooney just is such a tough guy at this <laughs> featherweight because he's so long, but it's so aggressive. Mm hmm Yeah, if he if, yeah. I think uh, that, that might be his, um, mm. that, might, that might be his uh, takeaway. Uh, you know, 20, 25 seconds left, seconds left here in the third round. Oh, exactly. Like, not Ooh. like adding just a little variation to his rhythm. <laughs> Kaito definitely goading Modi because you know he's, he's got that win. Yep. And this is where the mistakes happen. Clashing here going yeah. on. Here. Modi, if you can just add a little bit of that rhythmic variation, mm -hmm. um, it's only going to make mm. him better. But he just looks, he's had a great tournament. Great fight. Both fighters know that they are you know, top of their game, man. I, I, I love seeing at the end of the fight, you know, the bell rings and they're like, yep, good, excellent fight. I yeah. to, total respect. Well, they both tested each other to the extreme there. Kaito just, 
you know, getting that that one blow that made the difference. Mm -hmm. It's essentially one strike that changed yeah. everything. In this yeah. My Moody, though, man, I love this kid. He is he has an a, animal. Yeah, he has a peak. Should, he should have sunglasses on because his future is bright. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> ジャッジ勝本、30対28、赤小沢。ジャッジ勝本、30対28、赤小沢。以上判定3対0をもちまして、勝者赤コーナー。小沢、カイト。Wow, yeah. great fight, Miss. Yeah. Yeah. Lots of respect. Oh yeah, great matchup. Yeah. Had so much drama in that matchup, but no, no need for Mahmoudi to feel disappointed here. No. Uh, he gave, you know, gave it his all. Two incredibly tough fights yeah. in one evening. Yeah, two, two incredibly tough low blows, man. Props to Mahmoudi. So they have at the K1 World Grand Prix 2016 Japan, K1 Featherweight World Championship Tournament at the Yogi National Gymnasium at the Second Gymnasium. See you next time.